Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Meet the Ferrum Team. My name is Tom from the marketing team here at Ferrum Network and please welcome my dear friend, also from the marketing team at Ferrum Network, David. Hey David, how are you doing? Hi everyone, I'm super excited to be here. Yeah, I'm super excited for you to be here because um, I, I work with, uh, for everyone, you know, watching, um, I work with uh, David very closely um, every single day. David yeah. is amazing at what he does but he will tell you in a in a minute um what's uh, what's his role but before we actually do that david um could you just uh, briefly introduce yourself and tell us um what's your crypto story how did it all started yeah yes uh, i am david scandroli from argentina i am web designer and i think like in 2018 uh, i heard about the crypto um for the first time um, I was working with a company in Spain, Freelance, and all, I have a problem with the company because they sent me the, the payment and I need to wait like a week or 10 days to, to have the money on my bank account. So that was a, a, a very, very big problem for me. So one day a friend tell me that there are like a, a, a virtual coin, the uh, token, um, he told me like, you need a wallet, um, you can buy and sell the token and send to, to anywhere. So I start uh, looking some information and I found the Bitcoin, I found the, the Ethereum. And for me, the, that was a solution because I, I, I have the, my money in like one day. So for me, it was, was incredible. Um, that was um, uh, that is how I got into the the crypto world. Okay, this is cool. This is cool actually because usually people say you know like oh I heard about Bitcoin or like Ethereum um, you know yeah. and I, I I wanted to purchase it like that's how I started blah blah blah. But here you've actually got like real life utility um, provided by crypto and that was the key point when you decided you know. Just okay. Well, I need to use it. I want to use it because it's quicker. Like the payment transactions, yeah, yeah, it's quicker. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. That's cool. Okay, David. And what's your story? Um, how did you end up working at Ferrum Network? Um, I think like this is 2019. I found a, on a shop platform that uh, a company, a company of technology, uh, they need like a professional to make the the website. So I sent a mail and we start. Uh, we started with the the first site of Ferrum, and in a short time, I remember that we we, we create the first uh, the first website. So since that day, we have been working uh, in a many projects <laughs> with Ferrum. Uh, we make staking play staking projects, uh, websites, uh, banners, and a lot of things. And in January on 2022, this year, uh, Nichelle um, and Jan told me that they wanted me to be full-time with Ferrum, all the time with Ferrum. Uh, and that for me was incredible. It was an uh, incredible day. Uh, I remember I said, I don't, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, it's incredible because I was uh, working with Ferrum with a lot of time. And, and then uh, it, it's, it's incredible. And now we, we have a incredible company. We, we have a very good team, a marketing team, the dev team. We are, uh, we are incredible. Yeah, yeah, that's what I think as well. That's what I think as well. And what's absolutely so amazing is that you you know you're you're you've actually been the, one of the first people um, employed by Ferrum Network. Like you know you know Ferrum Network like you know the company you know the people like the amount of things that you've worked on and you've seen um and you've experienced that firm you know the constant development and change and you know just moving yeah. forward that's so good that's so good yeah. and uh, for everyone um watching us right now as well you this may be the first time you see um david 
um, uh, you know, with, with your own eyes basically in front of you. But day, you've seen David's work and you see it pretty much every single day, probably like five times a day, um, yeah. because David is doing all the amazing um, graphics, all the designs, um, the current website designs, also um, David's work. Um, our backgrounds, you know, that's also yeah. David's work. Everything to do with um, any anything with designs at Ferrum Network, it's David. So how is it? How is it working? And how is it? Well, how is it working at Ferrum Network? Tell us a little bit more about your role. Um, I am the graphic web designer of Ferrum. Uh, I manage the the website. I create uh, all the banner for the community, uh, all the mails that the 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 company need. Um, I work uh, with the staking page. I make the design. I, I make the coding. Um, and the last month, we we work a lot with the user interface of the application, like uh, Crucible, Token Bridge, or uh, Infinity Swap. We I work with with all of that. Yeah, that's so good, and there's so much. And I honestly, every single day, I'm just thinking to myself, oh my gosh, how is he doing it? All of this like so quickly. And it's, it always looks so good, honestly. And a um, uh, couple days before we've um, published this video, we've published the interview with Crucible Alpha testers. And every single person that's been testing Crucible so far mentioned that the UX and UI design of Crucible is immaculate it's honestly it's it's beautiful and it makes crucible the easiest and like the most simple to use DeFi product that they've seen which is pretty much unheard of unfortunately unheard of because in DeFi, you know there should be all the products um, and interfaces they should be easy um the the process should be easy to follow um but unfortunately that's not the case but with crucible thanks to you david it is so that's great and um what can you tell us uh, in terms of your biggest achievements so far at ferrum network what are you the most proud of wow um in Ferrum we we got a, a a very good project um but i think the the thinking page for me was were they are incredible uh i make the the new website the new website is so beautiful and, and fast uh, i like it but for me, the best thing, uh, the user interface of the Crucible for me is the best. Uh, I love, we work a lot, we make, no, I don't know how many hours, but uh, not only me, all the team, the dev team, uh, with marketing team, all, all firm work in, in that process. So for me, the Crucible is, is incredible. Yes, that's very nice, very nice, David. I love that, I love that. And um, what, because you are working on a lot of things, you know, from the yeah. UX, UI and design perspective, um, you work on a lot of things at Ferrum as well. And recently we've uh, reintroduced the new design for our website. Um, we have, um, uh, we have uh, introduced the alpha testing of Crucible as well with those designs um, and other things as well. What do you, but you also created the visuals for um, the ecosystem and the roadmap as well. Um, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, so, so, so my next question is, what do you find the most exciting um, from Ferrum that we are currently working on? Wow, uh, uh, in, in Ferrum we are creating all the time great solution for, for the community. Um, it's difficult, but the crucible for me is uh, so important. But the, the token bridge, the new design, the infinity swap, the new design of the infinity swap uh, is going to be like uh, we are we are going to make the difference with, with that tools. Uh, Ferrum is going to make uh, a difference. So for me, that was incredible. I, I love I love the, the new interface, the um, the the new the new design is 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 very good yeah no i agree i agree i agree i agree and to be completely honest it's so difficult to actually pick you know one one thing like you know with the crucible with no. mainnet with no. with like infinity sort with so many things that we are rolling out um and we are finalizing now it's it's impossible it's impossible but what you said you know we are gain we are changing the the game we are changing the space 
Um, yes. I, I agree. I fully agree. Um, but now, David, you've been involved with crypto for um, for some time now. For It's been, you know, a good couple of years already. What would you say, apart from FRM and FRM token, yes. um, what would you say are your favorite crypto projects out there? Mm, uh, there are many good projects. Uh, I particularly like uh, Animal Concerts. For me, it's a, it's a great project uh, with a lot of experience in the, in, the, in the team. I love, but I have a favorite that this Chibi Dinos. Uh, Chibi Dinos is another great project. It has a beautiful graphics and it, it's going to be a big project. So they, they mix the, the sport, NFT, the, the crypto world. So for me, Chibi Dinos going it's going to be a, a good project that I, I love. I love the, the Chibi Dinos. I love the designs of the Chibi. It was, it's incredible. Oh, that's so good. That's so good. I love it. I love it. And I literally, um, I, I was just um, putting out the video that's also available on our channel. Um, uh, Nathan's uh, video interview with the Chibi Dinos team with some exclusive content, um, video demos and trailers um, in there as well. So um, for everyone, go and check it out as well um, to make sure that you know what David's uh, talking about. Because um, Chibi Dinos is looking great. It's looking sick. I absolutely love it. Um, and David, my final question of this video, um, what would you say, what advice you'd give to someone entering the world of crypto? Okay. Um, I, will, I will tell you two things. Uh, the first, uh, be careful with the scam. Uh, there are so many in the crypto world. And the second, if you like a project, if you like you, you, you need to investigate. You need to read the, the white paper, see the roadmap, search information, go with the, the community. Uh, the community is very important for, for, the, for the project. So uh, that is very important. Yeah, absolutely. Doing your own research, that's the key. That's the key. Yeah. That's absolutely key. <laughs> Yeah, if, if, if you want to find legit um, good um, uh, projects, you need to do your own research, you do need to follow the communities, you need to join the communities, you need to see what they're working on, what's the roadmap, what are their mission, what's the vision behind the project, um, and what they want to actually change in the space. Um, so I fully agree with that, that was, um, that was very good. And I think that's pretty much it, David. That's all of our questions. Do you have any final thoughts? Thank you, Tom. Thank you so much. Uh, for me, it's a pleasure to uh, work with you in Peru. Thank you. Uh, you give me... You are a, a very good person. Uh, <laughs> you, are a, you are incredible. So not only me, the marketing team, we are a lot uh, of the team work incredible. So thank you so much. Sorry for the delay. Uh, we are working in a lot of projects, in a lot of, in a lot of things, but thank you and thank you so much. Thank you, David. Thank you for taking the time to be here. Thank you for your answers and thank you for the knowledge that you shared with us. Um, and yeah, it's a pleasure. It's honestly a pleasure to, to work with you. You're absolutely amazing. You're super, super, super fast. So like we call it, you know, fair and speed. Um, you're, you're, you're amazing. So thank you so much for... Um, for being at Ferrum, um, for providing our community with incredible designs, for making our products incredibly beautiful and easy and simple to, to follow as well. Um, and once again, thank you so much for being here, David. Thank you, Tom.